G'day everyone and welcome to another episode. We have arrived at Paranella Park. We've just finished the day tour around the place. Um, where it, this place is amazing. There are no words for it at all. There's so much going on. Hello. <laughs> There's so many things to see. We weren't really planning to originally come and see this place. You're eating seaweed crackers again. <laughs> Gotta get like four boxes of seaweed crackers, otherwise each one's gone in a day. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, this place is amazing. There's, mm. We weren't really expecting what we were to expect. Not at all. Not no. at all. But I'll show you around a little bit because I only really took videos of a few things because um, you really need to come here and experience it yourself the yeah. history and what they're doing to actually help preserve the yeah, place help preserve this place and what it done it's absolutely crazy and yeah. mind-blowing as well it's amazing. so I'll show you around So when you're walking through towards Teresa Falls, there's this little tunnel. And I don't know if you can pick it up on here. This whole tunnel is full of little micro bats. You can just see them in the light out of the other end. Can we go back and get the fishing rods? No. <laughs> Why not? No. I might have a chance of catching something. No. Uh, I probably wouldn't catch anything still. Probably. You would though. I would. Over there on that log coming out of the water is a heap of turtles on uh, top. Do you yeah, see them? I can. Do you see the one trying to crawl on top of the other one's back? Can you see it on a log over there? <laughs> There's like one, two, three, four, five. Turtles. I was trying to crawl him on his back. I think... Oh no, he just fell off. <laughs> <laughs> Poor fella. really really cool so you guys have to come here and check this out for yourself now if you are heading around you are camping caravan camper trailer whatever, whatever you got. they've actually got an on-site caravan park here so we've actually parked up here we've got like this whole rainforest as our backdrop mm, beautiful. it's absolutely stunning so it is Humid. yeah we are getting into the tropics so we are, you know, it, in the <laughs> it is a little bit crammed in, but like it's not nothing bad. You've got like little things covering everyone. We're lucky we've got our own spot. Yeah, mm. this is what a single spot. It's not a double spot. Yeah. Here, so. so I think it's something to do with we've got a camper trailer because they said apparently this spot is specific for camper trailers. So we'll take it though. 
they do also have like an overflow area which they call is it it was the paddock wasn't it the paddock yeah yeah called the paddock so, so it's got to be self-contained for that one yeah fully self-contained gray water and everything like that as well yeah so, so there's no toilets and showers at that one that's only it was like the 200 meters away 300 mm. meters away mm. it wasn't very far at all this little girl though is being very very good now they do have pet sitting available they have pet sitting here well it's not really pet sitting it's sort of pet minding so yeah. they you they've got a little cafe and everything you can't take dogs out to the cafe it's just this little front deck area now they've got like a little greeter person there and it's basically a spot where dogs can sit um they chain them up there water or stuff it's very lovely actually but we decided once we got here it was really cool it was a nice open area we haven't actually done it yet a lot of people say they will with caravans they leave their dog in the van turn the air con on do all that fun stuff and when it gets hot we definitely won't be doing that oh hell no definitely definitely not but this is the first time we've done it we just left her inside we were only gone for about an hour or so yeah, water the fan was on and it was nice and cool all the windows are open had the breeze coming through so we felt okay doing it and she did really well she did really well as soon as we walked around the corner you see a little pop head up pop pop head pop pop a head pop up over the window she must have smelt a thesaurus coming or something you popping you popping <laughs> popping heads so so they do cater a lot here so it, it, it's really really lovely so but we're going to be doing the night tour night tour tonight later and on the skywalk tomorrow so we've got the skywalk tomorrow so that's about 30 minutes away you only stay here for the night so staying at the caravan park is all included in it it's another puppy it's another puppy yeah the staying here is all included in the admission yeah. so why not yeah so you get one night here so in the morning we'll pack up and then we'll head over to the skywalk yeah. and then that'll probably be it for that this episode yeah it won't be too crazy just a little bit about what this is because afterwards we're going to the Atherton table Lakes. can i just say one thing if you're if you want to come to paranella park and you are planning on you know camping somewhere max just said stay if, if you're deciding to stay here it is included with your admission it's the same price as your admission oh yeah it's the same price so if you're paying to camp here you get power and water for the same price as your admission so you're basically paying to camp for an overnight plus two admission tickets for the same price as what it would be just buying two admission tickets yeah. so that's that's something to, so if you can that's pretty good yeah, if you're camping and you've and you've got the ability you might as well yeah we could have come here yesterday and went over to the paddock but it was the same price for the paddock no water no power yeah no sewerage or gray water no, no shower no toilet so anything. we thought where we were in mission beach it was nice enough so we just yeah. stayed there for another night relaxed and chilled out and, and it's nice to have a shower <laughs> and it, it is nice to have a shower yep. it's it's a luxury for us at the moment and actually power is luxury power power is a massive luxury. luxury we don't generally do that so but we'll see how the night tour goes if we can take you along with that one yep. if you're about to see anything on the gopro if not we'll, we'll see you tomorrow at the skywalk at the skywalk hey.
getting the full rainforest experience this morning, aren't we? <laughs> Did the night tour last night. That was absolutely fantastic. I don't know what has come up on the GoPro, so hopefully you would have seen that by now. Um, but we're waking up this morning to head off to the Skywalk and it is pissing down rain. A lot. Even more. <laughs> As I keep talking. I don't know if you can hear it. That's probably all they can hear, that's what can't hear your voice. <laughs> So remember when we talked about Notch Point and when it was raining? It wasn't this bad at Notch Point. But it was windier. So it is quite nice that the rain's kind of coming just straight down. But we're mostly packed up anyway. We're just sitting here drinking our coffee. Waiting for the rain to disappear. This is probably what people don't show you when they live on the road, is all the fun stuff that happens in between. But this isn't meant to rain for too long, so once that happens, we'll uh, What's that happens when the rain stops, we shouldn't be too far away looking at the radar. We'll then try and pack this whole thing up and uh, make our way to breakfast somewhere. Food is good. Because yeah. we've only had coffee. Anyway. <laughs> Bye. We'll see you later. Bye.